There we go. Okay, so we're working on the generating certificate of insurance. This is mainly for events in parks. So if you're working on a project that says Explore Austin Music or Will's Austin Music Adventure, anything that's indoors, this doesn't apply. So it's something you want to check for my outdoor events. And this is how we generate a certificate of insurance. This is the general uh, technique. So we're here on Strings in the Woods on November 2nd, column V, and uh, all the information you mouse over, this is where we log in to the Austin Creative Alliance, who's our nonprofit sponsor. So we go to the website, and now we're going to go to, we're going to, after you log in, you're going to see this account profile, and my email is incorrect here, so I'm actually changing that. Oh wait, no, it is correct. My phone number is correct. Okay. Insurance, we're going to go request a certificate of insurance. Um, okay, so event name is called Strings in the Woods. You can get that from the spreadsheet. Project event name, Strings in the Woods. Uh, the full range, this is going to be 11 to 2018 to 11 to, let's see that works, okay. Venue name, we're going to do this one at Mary, I don't think I put it in there, did I? Seawright Park. Mary Moore Seawright Park. So venue it says revealed. Maybe I should do a little mouse over so that we know for the certificate. Put a note in there. Uh, Mary Seawright Park. Let's see if I'm spelling that correct. So I'm going to go over to Google to get the address. This is just for the certificate. So. Sometimes we make it public, sometimes we don't. Okay, good. So with the address. There we go. So copy this. Back to the Okay, so it didn't like okay, venue name. Venue address. Okay, City of Austin listed. Hmm. All right. Okay. Um, for the uh, for this particular event, we're going through the Parks Rec, and currently we're dealing with some issues about how to make it correct. But this is what I know, so I'm copying that. I'm putting them down here. Additionals be insured. If there's anybody additional that needs to be insured, there you go. And let's save Austin. And that's pretty much all there is to it. Uh, there's the event range. It's the strings in the woods. It's under my account, strings attached, contact email, contact person, Will Taylor, park. And once I submit this, it takes a day to three days. I'll, I'll get an email that actually looks like, let's see if I've got one here. To, it's going to be from Asaf. So I'll do a quick Soft new certificate. Here you go. And it looks like this. All right. And what I'd love to have happen next is to save that to uh, Google Drive. Okay. If, if you're in my email. Um, and then we'll have the link to it. So what I'd like to do is let's, let's just do an example here. This one's for 11.3. So I'm going to save it to Google. Drive, and I'm going to create a link and put it in the spreadsheet so it's easy to find. What the thing is good idea? So I'm going in here, and I just saved it. So theoretically, C O I should be there. So I'm going to... See what I mean? <laughs> C O I. Here it is, and let's make a link to it to put in there. So that's going to be. This little thing right here. We want to share and we want a link. Copy that so I can view it and go over to our. That's for the event on the third. Okay, right here. So we'll actually go over. Where is it? 
So it says yes. And then we go right click on that cell and insert link, right? Insert link. Okay. To the actual deal. Perfect. Uh, I think that covers it. So we downloaded it, we put the link there, that, that's showing that it's done. And you know, if we're still doing it, like we did it for this one up here, we could, we could go submitted. Let me put the data on there, right? right. Submitted. So that means, you know, we're waiting, waiting to receive or whatever. Okay. So when I come through there, then I'm like, well, let's check on it or whatever. Okay, uh, that's how we do that. So to review, you go to the website, you click on resources, go to insurance, request a certificate of insurance, fill out the forms, save and continue. Another way that you can find it is they, they have a Dropbox here for us. If you scroll down, if you go to account, I think, Settings menu. Huh. Profile. I bet that's it. There's a little Dropbox link. Where did they move it? Okay, resources. So this is their. This is my little Dropbox. I wish they'd fix that too. It's like. It's like. Long. Yeah. yeah, it's too long. It's it's um HTML. Uh, you can copy it, and then. It, they store all the certificates in this folder and all kinds of things. So we got the certificates, certificates of insurance there, the donations, and here's my contracts. So if I need to show that, it's all in there. All right, that ends this video. Thanks for your help.